What is going on, guys? <laughs> Bad Wreckers is back, and we are doing another movie trailer. This will be the second one we're doing. Um, we're doing it on the Spider-Man No Way Home official trailer that just released a couple minutes ago. Q-Tip, how excited are we to check this one out? <laughs> yeah, Q-Tip. I'm very excited. We've been waiting for this trailer since it got announced about 24 hours ago, and I've been waiting for this movie for the last, like, three years. So <laughs> Three he, years. He basically, like through the computer on the ground because it was taking so long to get this video I'm prepared. Waiting, so <laughs> waiting, I think man. we should we should probably do something before we watch the video. Yeah, no, let's see how long we can hold this up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, let's go ahead and dive right into this one. This is the first time, again, we're watching this, so you'll get our live first initial reactions. Let's do it. Here we go. Ever since I got bit by that spider, I've only had one week where my life has felt normal. That was when you found out. You botched that spell where you wanted everyone to forget the Peter Parker Spider-Man. We started getting some visitors. from every universe. Hello, Peter. You're not Peter Parker. I'm sorry, what was your name again? Dr. Otto Octavius. <laughs> Wait, no, seriously, what's your actual name? There are others out there. We need to send them back. So, Scooby-Doo this crap. You know, all this is kind of your mess. I know a couple of magic words myself, starting with the word please. Please, Scooby-Doo Scooby this crap. You're flying out into the darkness to fight ghosts. What do you mean? They all die fighting Spider-Man. It's their fate. I'm sorry, kid. Yeah, me too. Don't. Don't. Oh! There has to be another way. There isn't. They're a danger to our universe. You're not gonna take this away from me. Peter. You're struggling. Damn it. Everything you want, while the world tries to make you choose. Hey, man. It's all my fault. I can't save everyone. Yep. They're starting to come through, but I can't stop them. December 17th, exclusively at movie theaters. Tickets on sale November 29th, Spider Monday. There we go. Wow. Let's go. Interesting. Q-Tip, you've been waiting for this one. First initial couple words in reaction to this trailer. I'm just excited, man. I'm just really excited to go. Like, I really wish it was already out. <laughs> yeah, so I, I'm not super big into Spider-Man as you are. What was that box that he kind of like shot that spider web mm -hmm. at and mm -hmm. then pulled? Mm -hmm. I actually am not sure myself still. Okay. It hasn't been talked about a lot. Is that Tesseract? Not, I don't think it is a Tesseract. I think it's something else. <laughs> really? I don't know what it is. So I, you know what? what I'm, it's going to be a very important block. Yeah, oh, yeah. What, I'm, what I'm curious about is that since they're bringing back all these guys and they're like, ah, oh, you know, they're coming through from old timelines and universes and stuff. Are they gonna bring back the original? Um, what is it, Andrew Garfield? It's just Toby Wire and possibly Andrew Garfield. It's pretty almost. It's like almost confirmed. It's almost confirmed. Like, nobody has has seen, seen anything. Yeah. Exactly the truth about it, and like all the actors, like they said, like multiple interviews of Andrew Garfield, where he's like, "I'm not in the movie, guys. Like, I'm not. I swear to God, I'm not in the movie." But yeah. like, you know, it's like oh, they they would kill him if they if he said yeah. it's true. <laughs> yeah, I um, wonder. I wonder if they're going to have him in there because I know Sony's, again, taking over the movie again mm -hmm. after this. And that's why 
from my understanding, is why they're bringing back all these old characters, right? I, yeah, it's, yeah. so they want to connect all the universes and just, like, have all those plot lines to play with. Um, that's part of it. And, like, part of it's, like, kind of just, like, a throwback to just, like, kind of make it, like, so, uh, you know, just, like, that big, like, cinematic universe idea, I think. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Um, one thing I think is actually really interesting is that um, Peter's friends remember that he's still Spider-Man. Mm. It seemed like that mm-hmm. in, the, in the first trailer they, they released uh, a couple months ago, like the spell that Doctor Strange does, it's supposed to make everybody forget that he is um, that he is Spider Man. Right, you but know, we so did see it gets fucked up. They're so. supposed to forget that he's Peter Parker in general. Like, so yeah, to get him completely. Mm. So they still know who he is in the movie. Or if they're with that at the end of the movie, they won't remember who he is now when it gets fixed. You know what I mean? mm. Right. Um, and I, the reason why I brought up that cube was I did notice a spot in there, and we're gonna actually watch this again right after yeah. them recording this because. Uh, get it more blown up probably on the big screen but uh yeah. i did notice when because he shot the web at the box pulled it and the yep. next scene cut uh okay. dr strange right. kind of pulled spirit spider-man person. but the spirit yeah what's the deal yeah. with that he sent him into the spirit realm. <laughs> no, yeah no. i don't know some shit like that it's happened a couple times i know it happened in the dr strange movie I yep. that the ancient uh, the yeah. ancient lady yeah. she, she did she it to dr strange yeah and she does it to hulk, uh, the hulk when he goes oh, back yep. in time in yep. infinity war or in endgame i think it's yeah. Game. yeah so like I, I don't know what happened there but that'll probably be like a small plot point it looks like because it looks like what happens is pj realizes like to, for dr strange to fix it he's going to do something that doesn't want it to happen and so then dr strange and peter are going to fight him except mm, sure for a little bit of the movie at least yeah. sure um, a couple of the reports I did read yesterday as well um, from uh, interviews of Tom Tom Holland. Basically, it's he's making it sound like this is the end of an era. Yeah. There's basically no more Spider-Mans after this kind of thing. Do you yeah. believe that's the case with this one? I, Where do you think this movie is going to go in a direction? I Where do you think it's going to end? I think this movie is going to... I think um, this will be at the end of like Peter Parker like as a kid. I think they'll probably go mm-hmm. like more into that college direction mm-hmm. afterwards with this character into a more serious direction. Um, part of what's confusing is whether or not Disney and Sony will have that toxic and where Disney will continue to operate with him. Yeah, right. So I think what's going to happen is that this movie will be too successful for Sony to ignore that they should try to do it themselves because I think it would just be better if they kept letting Disney work on the property. Yeah. I I honestly wouldn't be surprised if this movie, like, were to, if the box office was, like, $2 to be honest. I would not be surprised if this, yeah. this movie hit, like, a $2 million box Well, it already, it already it's has been out for what? How long has the trailer been out? About 40 minutes. 40 minutes, yeah. It already has 4 million views as yeah. of before this video started. Yeah, yeah. as of yeah. 8 minutes ago. Yeah. So. So Ooh. it's definitely nuts. What are, what are your kind of thoughts? Where do you think it's going? Yeah, in the game? it looks it, it looks exciting. I mean, you bring back all these old characters that people yeah. have, and I think that's one of the reasons it's going to do very well is because it has all this um, these past characters that people are in love with. Like, dude, I fucking love Sandman. He was such a good character, and he was yeah. only on screen for was it five minutes in that one movie? Something, yeah. Um, he was right there. Yeah, he was barely in that movie. Mm-hmm. So. You know, yeah. I think having him come back, having Green Goblin come back, having Doc Ock, who has been one of the more prominent figures, um, mm-hmm. come back, I, I think it's going to be a pretty good movie. And hopefully we get some plot to us that they didn't release, yeah. which yeah. typically happens in Marvel movies. They yeah, typically have sure. some crap that you're like, whoa. Some stuff back. Yeah. Like I swear, they, they definitely are holding the Spider-Man back. I swear to God they are. Yeah. 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 Something. Um, did you see, did either of you see the end of Venom, the movie? I heard there was like a special ending in the end of that one um, that may hint towards Venom being in this movie. Any thoughts I about that? I don't think it's Venom, um, but it's weird because those movies have been trying to tie together for a long, a long time too, and that's mm-hmm. why part of this is so important, is because it can branch into that idea of Spider Man being in different universes. Because um, in the at the end of Venom 2, you do see like this weird shot of like the. Spider-Man from Tobey Maguire's era, like, it's his suit, like, on a poster yep. in the world. Mm. Well, so I don't know if you guys noticed it either, but in one of the scenes, it was showing um, Tom Holland's Spider-Man, and he, pretty much all the scenes, he had that new metallic suit that he yeah. got in the last mm-hmm. um, uh, Avengers movie. Yeah. Um, but there's one scene I noticed, and again, we'll watch it again and double check, yeah, but there's yeah. one scene I actually noticed where he had a normal suit on. Yeah, he has a different suit out. I didn't see that. I, I, I noticed that, and I was like, "Huh, interesting. interesting, interesting." Yeah. yeah. So I wonder again if there's some some sussery going on. In that. Yeah, very, very interesting. <laughs>
definitely some accessory going on. We're definitely excited for this one. Yeah. It comes out in about a month, I believe, what, 17th, December 17th, yeah, I believe. Yeah. Um, so we're definitely going to be keeping our eye out on this one. Maybe, do you think they release a second trailer? I really doubt it, Austin. I think yeah. they December 17th. Everything, everything yeah. else that they have revealed, month, but... everything else they have revealed, I think they want to keep under the lid. And like, yeah. a lot of the shots from this trailer were some of the shots they used in the last trailer. Yeah, too, so. yeah. yeah so definitely. They're definitely still trying to keep a lot of stuff under wraps. Yeah, no, that's for sure. So we'll be we'll keep watching out for this one. We're definitely going to be checking into this one. So make sure you're keeping up with us. Make yep. sure to drop us a follow on this YouTube video as well as our Instagram. We're posting <laughs> a ton of content all year long as well. Uh, stock advice, sports information as well. So make sure you guys are checking that out. Follow us for more videos like these. And we'll